Huawei is once again making headlines, and this time it's about something that could completely change the future of its smartphones and tablets. According to the latest leaks, Huawei is reportedly working on a brand new chip architecture called N Plus 3, and this could potentially be the long awaited 5 nanometer Kirin chip. If this turns out to be true, it might mark a huge step forward for Huawei's technology. For years now, Huawei has faced big challenges in the chip making industry due to restrictions on advanced semiconductor technologies. This forced the company to rely heavily on its own research and on partners like SMIC, the Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corporation. Because of these challenges, Huawei's chips have often fallen behind rivals like Snapdragon from Qualcomm or Dimensity from MediaTek. But the new reports suggest that Huawei is catching up faster than many expected. So what exactly is this Unplus 3 architecture that everyone is talking about? Well, the leak from a reliable source, Fixedficus, reveals that Huawei and SMIC are developing an improved chip design with a transistor density of 125 million transistors per square millimeter. To put this into perspective, that's equivalent to TSMC's 5.5 nanometer process. Compared to SMIC's older 14 nanometer process, which had a density of just 35 million transistors per square millimeter, this is a massive leap forward, more than 250% higher in density. Now, why is transistor density such a big deal? The higher the transistor density, the more powerful and efficient a chip can become. More transistors packed into the same space mean faster performance, better multitasking, and improved power efficiency, so if Huawei really manages to achieve this 125 MTR per millimeter density, the new Kirin chip could feel a lot closer to the performance of today's flagship processors, even if it's technically behind in terms of cutting-edge manufacturing. The reports also mentioned that this chip could be ready as early as 2026. That means we could see it debut in Huawei's future Pira or Mate smartphones, and maybe even in the MatPad tablets. Imagine a Huawei flagship phone powered by its very own 5 nanometer Kirin chip. That would be a major achievement for the company, especially given the difficulties it has faced in accessing advanced chip technology. Of course, there's still some caution here. Even though Huawei may be working on this 5 nanometer chip, it may not fully match the performance of chips from companies like Qualcomm or MediaTek. Huawei still lacks some of the most advanced chip making tools, which means its processors could lag behind the latest Snapdragon or Dimensity options. But at the same time, this new Kirin would still represent a massive improvement over the current generation. Users could expect smoother performance, better battery efficiency, and more reliable multitasking compared to existing Huawei devices. One interesting detail is that Huawei seems to be preparing its entire ecosystem for this next generation chip. The company has recently started displaying chip details directly in the About Phone section of its devices. This is a subtle but important change because it suggests that Huawei has a stable supply of processors ready for its smartphones. In the past, one of the biggest challenges for Huawei has been ensuring enough chips to power its lineup. But now, things look more promising, and this gives even more weight to the rumors of a 5 nanometer Kirin on the horizon. If this leak turns out to be accurate, Huawei could soon narrow the gap between itself and the competition. Having a 5 nanometer class chip would allow its phones to compete more directly with global flagships, at least in certain aspects like performance and efficiency. And for Huawei fans, that means better gaming, improved AI processing, faster app handling, and overall smoother user experiences. It's also worth noting that Huawei's potential 5 nanometer breakthrough comes at a very strategic time. The global smartphone market is extremely competitive, with companies like Apple, Samsung, and Xiaomi pushing hard with their latest technologies. Huawei needs a strong selling point to stand out, especially since it is still working under trade restrictions in some regions. A new Kirin chip with modern architecture could be exactly the boost the company needs to regain attention worldwide. For now, Huawei has not confirmed any of these details officially. These are leaks and rumors, and like always, things could change. But given Huawei's recent efforts to strengthen its chip supply chain and manufacturing processes, it does look like the company is pushing harder than ever to close the gap with the global leaders. What do you think about this possible breakthrough from Huawei? Would you be excited to see a new Kirin chip power the upcoming Pura or Mate series? Let's see how things unfold in the coming months, because one thing is clear, Huawei is not giving up, and the next chapter in its chip story might be the most exciting one yet.